Hey guys, this is Ace Kingdom here, and today I'm going to be doing a little real life video. In this video, should be a review on the Hyper Fire Elite from the Nerf, um, Nerf Elite line. So I'm gonna explain this whole thing, review it, before we enter the fire. So starting off with the front, you cannot attach any barrels or like intrac attachments. Here's the jam action door. You open it, clear the jam, close it, lock. This gun does not operate when this thing is not locked. So you make sure that this is locked after clearing the jam in order to fire. Then the magazine pretty obvious. Um this is the accelerator button. So you hold down the accelerator for like two or five seconds, then you hold down the trigger, there's this button here, and holding down the both again will fire it again. Over here is the area where you you know um where you Take it out and you put in the batteries. This thing only holds D style batteries. So now let's go over to the siren test. See you in a bit. Okay, here we are. Um, so this thing um, can fire pretty fast, but the D style batteries, pretty low um, power. Then go up to you. Well, here we go. That's pretty fast, guys. Like, what did you say? About, you know, five seconds? And I emptied, like, this thing is about 26 or 25 shots, rounds. And look at how many times I... Look at... Look at all this! I emptied at, like, five seconds. So, whatever I said, this gun is pretty good. Um, also, I'll be doing the Artemis later. Um, but I'll be focusing on this little boy. Um, yeah, that's the, that's the high fire. So over to the Artemis. Um, this is a pump action, unlike the hyper fire. The hyper fire was a fully automatic. This thing, you have to go like this. In order to fire, and you already get one or two shots. And they little balls. How about the balls? So, here's a loading point where you just, you know, put in the balls. You'll see what I mean. So, let's say you realize that you have an extra ball here, and you just slot it in like that, and there you go. So, this gun, you have a tactical rail up here. You have a, this thing, if you pull it back and forth, this thing can change, turn. And the trigger, nothing much. Um, on this side, you have the safety lock, so if I press it, you can fire. If I redone, then you can. Pretty cool. And, yeah, that's all for the yard. I hope you guys, so I hope you guys did enjoy that video. Um, it was a pretty short review, even though I reviewed on two different blasters. If you guys did enjoy that video, um, if you did, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.